Thor Ragnarok review. So what'd you guys think of the movie? <coughs> Go first, Jamie. Okay, it was really cool. I loved how fun it was. Uh, it was fast-paced and awesome, and I loved it. 10 out of 10. Great job, Taika. Taika. <laughs> it's the funniest one of the MCU that I enjoyed. It's super funny, and uh, like you said, it was really fast-paced. It didn't seem like there was ever really like a, a right. falling moment. It was always action-packed or fucking hilarious. Yeah, there one. were a couple times where people were falling. There was 30 minutes of falling. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was probably one of my top 10 favorite movies of all time. Like you said with the whole pace thing, I never felt bored at all. The thing that I really appreciated about it was that they took things that I was worried about initially and completely made me like that. I, I was right, very right. happy with everything. Like all the things that I was worried about, like Hulk and Thor's haircut, everything was. I, I it so they sold me on it. Yeah, Thor's haircut. I was so scared. I love how butchered <laughs> it was. I was so scared. And well, then, like, yeah, it, just, it was nice. Oh, well, I mean, like he looked hot still. Yeah, I was scared. Well, that. he's always hot. He's all. I mean, come on now, look at him. So let's get into spoilers Sweet, real quick. We're done. Let's no, no, <laughs> we're done. We did it. You're welcome, viewers. <laughs> okay, uh, spoilers. What, what was your favorite like part? It was easily, <laughs> easily. Well, oh shit, Korg. Korg. I couldn't remember if oh, it was Korg or Korg. No, I, I looked it up because you guys were saying Krog. Just the, <laughs> easily the best part of the movie for me. They were. He was hilarious, and every scene he was in, he stole the show. So for those of you who don't know, yes. Korg is played by the director. What's his name? Taika, Taika. Yeah. So and it's not Jermaine Clement, which I thought it was. So yeah. No, it is not. And Mick is, well, a slug thing with arms that are Ooh, nice. Who has no voice actor. Yeah. Well, he friend. probably has a voice he actor. Made noises. But like, but you it's can... just some guy. Like, they could have just grabbed the janitor and been like, hey, make some grunting noises. <laughs> <laughs> they grab the janitor and they're like, we need you. And then they just choked him for a little yeah. bit. <laughs> just all the humor all together was just my favorite parts. Like, especially the, with like where the haircut and he's like, you touched my hair. If you cut my hair, you'll fight the feed, whatever. And, and so like, he just hair. sailing, just boop, 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 please don't cut my hair. <laughs> <laughs> That and the scream when he's like going through the thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Also, <laughs> that, that was Willy Wonka yes, music. Yeah. That was entirely the tunnel scene where he's just like, a world of pure imagination. Well, and it yeah, just hits that's the fucking... what they did in the tunnel scene of Willy Wonka. Right, yeah, yeah, I get that. But, but say, they that were was playing a, Willy Wonka was music like, while they was turned similar, into the tunnel. It was a similar idea, yeah, but that wasn't the like, same music or... No, the, no, that was, it was a total totally rip It was an fucking own. pure imagination. It was 100% pure imagination. Was it? Yeah, yeah it that was, was the entire melody. Because okay. like, I hummed it the entire time. Uh, I mean, like, I I'm sure that was great for the other people in the theater. <laughs> well, like, I, I sung it out loud. Buddy, buddy <laughs> mentioned volume. that. Well, I thought that he was just, like, comparing it. Yeah, no, I thought, it like, saying, like, like, oh, it's no, that's well, it. I like it. And then I was like, oh, wait, no, that definitely huh. isn't. All right. <laughs> yeah, okay. Jeff Goldblum. He was great. Everything he did. <laughs> yeah, that was, I was going to say, that's my favorite part. Yeah. yeah. Sold it. Like, kind of equal to court for me was Grandmaster. <laughs> Right. He was just so condescending about everything. He's getting goo on me. I'm <laughs> stepping in the goo. <laughs> How'd you feel about the whole banner coming back and realizing, like, oh, I'm on a different planet? How long have, like, did we did we do it? Did we get all that? It's like, I dude, liked that. That was two years ago. And it's like, what? I did enjoy that, how they was like, oh, it was fucking two years later and he had no right. clue. But when they did that transition to banner, it felt... Like, really weird and forced, and he just, his acting was real shitty. I thought that, too. Yeah. I didn't, I did well, not I mean, like, like the transition. His thing. voice was really very strange. I don't even know how to describe it. He was, like, a whole other person. He did seem more Italian than usual. Like, he kind of had that, uh... Like, his Hulk voice was, too. like, way higher pitched. Like, and, uh, like uh, the dude from Criminal Minds. Was weird. I thought the action in this movie was really well done. Oh, oh yeah. Like, yeah. every scene was choreographed amazingly, and they were shot really well. They made the... The actual super characters feel super in this. Yeah. Oh like, yeah. they were just destroying anybody who wasn't on their level, which is nice to see in a movie. There's just like, there's a million dudes, but this is the god of thunder or the god of death. And, like, they're going to fuck... They're going to fuck up a million guys because they can't. Okay, I still don't understand how the god of death's only power was throwing sharp things. Uh, because what do sharp things do when they pierce your body... Like, like, death. like oh, you die. Well, she also, the god she of death. She also didn't throw them. She could also su like she summoned them basically, like the giant one that grabbed the ship. She well, did that. Yeah, I'm not saying. To be that, fair, that's, that's more, all she did. Though. That's more than Malekith I mean, did. 
I'm not yeah, saying otherwise. All I'm Thor just does saying... is shoot electricity. But to like, be you fair, if you, you can Malekith boil... was just a king that was an elf. Yeah. yeah. He fucking... really had no power whatsoever. Right, they were gods. The fucking I mean, you can boil anybody's power down to Iron Man like a single rays. sentence. <laughs> Loki okay. just tricks people yeah. and he sometimes uses knives. <laughs> <laughs> just tricks people. I just just the guy guy yeah, yeah, well, you God said damn. she just so su- she just That's so all she did things. though. Is she throws sharp shit? That's yeah. her thing. Yeah, and she it, killed almost all of Asgard, which is what's sad about it. I'm like, what's these also, are fucking like they're Viking. There could be a possibility of people. The weapons themselves being like death is touch. I mean, I hope. I fucking hope so. Like they one, need to. I feel like they should have explained that a little she stabbed, bit. I mean, like, she one of them stabbed just, Thor like a million yeah, times. She's and like, he yeah, die. You know, but he's also on the one God time level. in the face. Yeah, that was the slice. Although well, that, like, again, she I still don't get why the like, prosthetic. She yeah. stabbed yeah. one of them. The prosthetic the stomach, wasn't great. And right, they, they didn't have the eye hole. Right, he should have had an eye hole. I don't think there was a prosthetic. I think they just were like, no, they wink just with paint. wink with one eye, and we're gonna paint in you. Yeah, keep your exactly. eye fucking closed. The rest of this is just someone shoot. just yeah, ate his chicken that day, his and then they put a shit, like, piece of chicken skin over his face for a sec, and they're <laughs> like, "This is fun." Uh, that was the one complaint I really had about the movie was the eye wasn't. Yeah, I wasn't great. a fan of the okay. eye. Like I could have done better than that, and I'm not professional at anything. Hey Brandon, real quick, uh, what do you think about Doctor Strange being able to kick Loki's ass? Oh, I thought it was funny. Okay, good. The way they set it up was it was a prep fight, if you go with that. Well, yeah, but... Like, don't get me wrong. I, it was funny, and yeah, I, you know, on some on my fanboy level, I'm like, oh, you motherfuckers. To be fair, also, uh, Loki didn't even have, like, a fighting chance. Yeah, exactly. Fight. It was just, hey, you're getting fucking teleported. Hey, you're getting fucking yeah, teleported If Loki again. was good, he'd be able to fight against that. Well, it was He didn't know what the fuck was happening. He was, was happening. literally he was suddenly falling a portal for 30 minutes. <laughs> he had... Nothing he could do. You mean the most basic thing that Doctor Strange had to learn? Teleportation? Loki couldn't Uh, He had a magic little ring that made him do that. Loki's supposed to be better. And Loki's supposed to be... Yeah, he's naturally better. He has the magic already. He didn't need a little ring thingy. I'm just saying exactly. he was taking taken off guard immediately. Yeah, and it's thrown like, into a portal oh, that was yeah. literally him falling. This way. For yeah, no, 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 I get that. That's fine. You That's and fine. I are gonna fight, but we start the fight after I hit you in the face with a bat. Go. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's no, no, what no, no, happened. No. <laughs> he's Asgardian. He can survive that fall, and he was fine. He stood up. He's just like, so you think you know magic? And Doctor Strange is like, get the fuck out of here. Well, yeah, that and God, he was just pissed. Seconds. He's just like, he pulls out some knives. He's gonna stab this asshole. He's. Not thinking, oh, I'm gonna get teleported again. That's logical. The tele it was that, open. That's it super showed logical. where he was it going. Is. No, that, you you the the immediate thought if if I get teleported into like another dimension where I'm just falling and then I get teleported back out and there's this asshole, my first thought is gonna be this guy can teleport me places, not I'm gonna stab him, this guy's nobody. Like, okay, that's <laughs> <another thing. laughs> there's like, there's hang on. Yeah, he knows shows Norway. Let me my phrase. He knows the one thing about Doctor Strange, and that is that he can teleport. That's the only thing he should expect. <laughs> if Doctor Strange pulled out a knife and stabbed him, then he can be surprised. Like, oh shit, I thought you could just teleport people you stabbed too. What but, like, he should never be surprised by okay, the teleport. Another thing Again. also <laughs> is that the portals were stationary. Yeah. And then suddenly Doctor Strange is like, I'm going to throw this portal at you. That's fair. And then on top of that, he was pissed. When you're pissed off, you don't think logically. Yes, that is the logical thought. The one thing! He was teleported! That should be the only thing he's thinking about. He had time to fall for 30 minutes and think about how much he got teleported. And how could he not teleport himself out? Again, I'm going to hit you in the face with a bat. It's not like getting hit, because he didn't get hit. It's more like, oh, you put a blindfold on him and spun him around in a circle three times. Now fight. You got spun around. You're a little bit dazed, but, like, you're not in any physical pain. Your ability to think is not in any way affected. So you're telling me if you were falling for literally a half hour, you would just be like, you know? Coming from people who probably can teleport out of here. You wouldn't be immediately panicking. That's they go my first thought, is panic cult. and die. Let it's me go. He, he already did the fall thing, where he was like, I'm gonna fall off the Asgardian bridge and just teleport. That He did it, he already did that. In the first movie, he let go of... Yes. And We he, don't know how much time is between that, though, that he recovered or whatever happened. He that's fair. Yeah, we don't know how long he fell. He's, he could have fallen, fallen for, like, a minute. 
That's true. What the he survived worse if things. If he fell for a minute, that's even worse. He was able to figure, like, figure out what he was going to do in a minute of falling, but in he thirty minutes of falling, do Doctor Strange. That's just he didn't do anything. He didn't like. He didn't magically make himself that's, like teleport or whatever. That's he what fell I'm in saying. a wormhole. He didn't that he do literally anything. stated in the second movie that there are doors everywhere. That's how I'm here. Yeah, but he can't <laughs> use those. I mean, like that—that that was—that I mean, that was just, all it took the entire time. He just knows where they are. He doesn't like keep them in his pocket. Like, well, to be fair, yeah, in uh, the dark world, they just put him in a regular ass cell, and he was stuck in there. So I guess Loki right. kind of sucks. True. Yeah, Loki. Okay, so that's what we've arrived at. Loki's just kind of <laughs> not great. So all Britain's favorite characters suck. How do we beat Loki? Uh... Just have Doctor Strange put him in another wanna, dimension. Do you guys just want to put him in handcuffs? I think that'll work at this. Yeah, yeah I have like this ball of twine. We could just tie his hands <laughs> He'll together. He'll just be angsty <laughs> towards you, and that's all he can do at that point. Although, <laughs> I, yeah, I guess well, that I mean, is like, true. Like, fucking Valkyrie was just like, I'm going to put some chains up. on you and leave you in this, this room. Yeah. And he's like, damn, well, she well, got me. <laughs> well, he gets captured a lot. At Nobody's least I'm not that, falling. Well, the thing is, is that they've never said that he knows magic. Him saying, you he think did. you know magic to Doctor Strange. Well, the thing is, is in his world, magic and science are literally the same thing. He's not or the same magician as Doctor exactly. Strange. Exactly. He's not a, like, we've he's we've like had a, the discussion. He's, where, uh, he's like a magician, but a scientist. <laughs> Loki's like no, an he's illusionist. he's actually like a magician. He's just an illusionist. He does magic tricks. He doesn't, at least in the MCU, he doesn't have, like, the same level of shit. What was the worst right. thing about the movie for you? Uh, it was another pretty disappointing Marvel villain. And it was just like, hey, I yeah, don't you know, relate to or care about what you're doing at all, and you're gonna die, and I'm not gonna care whether you come back or not. Right, like right. it's it's the same the same thing with every Marvel villain. They're unrelatable, and their goals are pretty much like I don't really care about that, and it, it just didn't matter at all. Cool thing about this is that the finale really was the heroes being like. We're gonna. We brought two villains together, and we're gonna let them destroy each other while yeah. they leave. Enemy of my yeah, enemy. that was a nice little thing. Speaking of that, do you think so? Do you think Loki took the test rag? Totally. Yes. Definitely. Oh yeah. Totally. We had to have. I mean, that was definitely leading up to. Infinity That's probably War. how we got on the ship. Marvel movies are also notoriously bad at emotional scenes. Like the emotional scenes never make you actually feel emotions. As someone who often sits next to people who cry during movies. <laughs> <laughs> and I know what they're experiencing. And I know what, I, I empathize with what they're experiencing. I don't, I don't think I've ever sat next to someone who cried during a Marvel movie. <laughs> the Anthony Hopkins scene, I agree it wasn't great, but I did enjoy that it was like Thor immediately throws the blame on Loki. Yeah. He's like, yeah. That, yeah, that was furious. <laughs> well, that's the good part about it. That was the redeeming quality of him dying. Like, the I, way he died wasn't good. I would have liked for that to be a little longer, that part. Where I would I would have liked for them to argue and like it looked and like they the, were about yeah. to fight and then Hella immediately Hella, showed up yeah. and it's like I would have liked to see the brothers actually yeah. have some sort of and clash. She, but the sister she was, was there now. Nowhere. The sister's involved. <laughs> yeah, that's Dad's true. Death. Like, where are you at again? And how did you get here? Like, yeah, like you just did you meet to the to... fucking Bifrost to get to Asgard? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. My negative thing was there were points where Hulk looked bad. Yeah. Mm. Like, I know when Thor first hits him and he goes across the wall, it does a cut to him, like, pushing himself out of the wall. And that was horrible. That was one of the worst CG things I've yeah, ever was, seen. When, His butt should have been way more bodacious. That's true, too. <laughs> I agree with yeah, that. Yeah, it like was a, flat, squishy, yeah, like a yeah. flat ass. It should have showed his dick. <laughs> I, I want to see that. Well, like, the one I'm scene where... Uh, they didn't. Well, yeah, where, you're uh, surprised yeah. they didn't I'm show actually, a dick? I'm kind of the Hulk's dick. Like, they didn't like. They don't show oh. dick in like hard R movies. What do you? What do you think I'm they're going to show in some PG thirteen comic book movie? They didn't do a like a better like joke or something at it, like a shadow of his Be dick or like, something. Or like besides like Thor's going. Oh, that's, that's in my brain I would have liked for him to turn around and Thor get immediately knocked out. I would have <laughs> thought like like a, if he like hugged him or something like oh wait where was Sif? Sif? Yeah, Sif was the black girl. Sif was, was not the white black girl. girl. That's Valkyrie that you're thinking of. Oh, right. Yeah, Sif, Sif was, was not there. Yeah, you're she right. Was, you're right. She you're was right, in right. an episode of Agents like, of S.H.I.E.L.D., but she won't be in the next Thor movie. I forgot she was even in, like, the well, first they kill, Thor movie. Well, they killed the Warriors Hogan, 3. Hogan, Volstagg, and Fandral. Right, I completely second, forgot so. Sif was even, like, a thing in the MCU. So, all right. We all loved the movie. 
Yeah, yeah very good. Um, give it all your money. Make it. Give it a solid 9 out of 10. I might go see it a second time. Yeah, yeah might as well. I'll probably go see it a second time, too.